like i said you can go to your chrome and download an image which is which the aspect ratio is in 16.9 um aspect ratio okay so here's what i'm going to do i have already downloaded i have already downloaded the image that i want to use so i'm going to go to my gallery and pick it so i'll go to my gallery and here is the blank picture the 16.9 this is 16.9 aspect ratio image i got using my chrome browser as you can see it's a blank picture have you seen that's that's the ratio i want to use so this is it so i will come here and i will say create an image image of a boy sorry and let me say of an african boy or african baby playing in a puddle a puddle of water a puddle of water using the aspect ratio of the referenced image now i'm going to send this and then we are going to wait for our image to generate now can you see here is our result let me click on it for you to see can you see this this is our result this is our result now if you can look at this image you see that there are some spaces that the the um image do not really occupy like there there's a border yeah so we are going to correct that in our next image prompting okay so now i'm going to get an image from my gallery let's say an image that i have already generated i'm going to get it and then we are going to do the next step so now i'm going to my gallery i'm going to upload it now this is now gemini has registered this as my first image okay this has been registered as my first image now i'm going to go and then pick the second image which is this blank uh uh, reference picture i had already downloaded so i'm going to click on it and it will come up as a second image so i already typed my prompt and i'm going to paste now that's what i said in my prompt prompt use the second picture as the reference for the final aspect ratio feel and feel the area that wasn't shown in the original picture which is this the picture should be in a close-up view zooming in on the woman's face now I'm going to send this and then we are going to wait for our result to generate. Then you're going to see the result below. Okay. So here is what we have. Have you seen? It has automatically taken the 16.9 aspect ratio. So this is what our image. This is what our image looks like in 16.9. So these are for those people that are going to use it for their YouTube. Uh, videos and then you want to generate this into a video you can instead of going to flow and view three to get um an aspect ratio of this nature or probably maybe you have already generated your image in 16.9 or let's say 3.3 or let's say 1.1 which is a regular square picture that gemini produces and then you take it to view three to generate your image your video or flow and then it crops it out for you it crops out some parts so i feel this is better this is actually better so you can use this to generate your picture okay you can attach your image as the first picture use this as the second the blank um 16.9 uh, ratio image as the second picture and then you type in your prompt and it to develop your prompt within that aspect ratio so that some details of your image is not going to be what cropped out so everything will be there in your image so using this i can use this for whatever i want to use it for and remember i said that i wanted a zooming in on the woman's face so let's assume i did not use that zooming in on the woman's face then it would have given me every detail of this image okay it would have given me every detail of this image okay let me just quickly edit that out and let's see the results 
So I'll just do this. Let me see. Uh, um, shown in the picture. Let me edit that out and then send so that we'll see how this image will be captured in a 16.9 aspect ratio. So let's wait for the result. So here's the result. So can you see this? I mean, like, can you see this? Every detail of the image was captured in 16.9 aspect ratio. So if you're seeing this video, please like comment share and follow my page for more details and tutorials like this